so have today well that was a really exaggerated high um so i'm just really excited today i have a halloween tutorial for you all today right now right now um <laughs> it is a zombie sailor i don't know i just thought it was really cool i know there's lots of zombie tutorials out there but i really like zombies like i'm actually obsessed with them like i love zombies so i thought i just had to do a zombie tutorial at least once so here's my zombie tutorial so I thought I'd make it a little bit different. Um, well, I mean, like, overall, this, they're the same, but I thought I'd add a theme to it as well. So a zombie sailor, because I know a lot of girls like being sailors for Halloween. Um, so I thought, you know, if you wanted to still be a sailor, but kind of wanted to add a little twist to your outfit, you could be a zombie sailor, because it would be just as cool, if not cooler. So, yeah, this is my little zombie sailor. There's all the makeup. Super duper duper easy to do. So let's get into the tutorial and I hope you guys like it. So I'll just give you another close up on the face. And you can also fill in your eyebrows if you'd like. I just didn't, or add false eyelashes as well, depending on how pretty you want this look to be or not. Even if you don't want to be um, a zombie sailor, you can still use this tutorial to be just a normal zombie. Make it as gory as you like or as least gory as you like. First we're going to apply our liquid latex and I just got this at the Halloween store and I'm just putting it places where I want um, extra texture for the bruises and wounds that I'm going to put on my face. So you're going to have to let it dry a couple minutes. This is what it's going to look like when it's dry. We're then going to take yellow face paint and also moisturizer because it's like really drying and it dries really really fast this will just ensure that we can like work with it easier and you're just going to apply this all over your face and down your neck as well i'm then going to apply white face cream along with the moisturizer again just to kind of like dim down the yellow a little bit after all your face cream is applied then just apply a translucent powder on top to kind of set it in place Then we're going to grab our eyeshadow. First we're going to be using green. I'm just mixing like a Kelly green along with the lime green. And where you put the liquid latex, you're going to put this lime green all around those edges. Then we're going to add purple eyeshadow and we're going to put this directly over the green but we're also going to leave the green on the edges so that we're just kind of creating a bruise look right now. Make sure that you apply the purple eyeshadow everywhere that you applied the green eyeshadow to make sure that everything looks bruised. I'm then going to be grabbing red eyeshadows and I'm putting this everywhere where the liquid latex is. This is just kind of like to prep for the blood. Then I'm going to be putting it underneath my eyes, red and purple, to kind of make myself look really tired and make my eyes look really like inset and deep. I just added an extra bruise here on the same steps as before minus the liquid latex because I felt like I was kind of missing something. Then we're going to grab our blood and I'm just using a synthetic brush to apply this and we're going to apply this directly over the liquid latex. I'm going to layer it as well and kind of apply it everywhere that I feel that it's needed. When you layer it, it just kind of looks more real. I'm just going to contour a bit now. I'm going to go underneath my chin and as well on my cheekbones, but be careful because you just put the blood there. Um, you can also do this before. Now I'm going to be creating my winged eyeliner since we're a sailor and sailors generally have winged eyeliner, at least in costume form. I'm going to apply red lipstick as well. And uh, you're done. So thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you guys enjoy. Also, I wanted to tell you guys about a video I made for the Pet Collective. They started a series called The Pet Haul featuring beauty gurus just like me, where instead of reviewing beauty products or clothing, we're reviewing products for our pets. I did a haul of my sister's cats, so check it out in the annotation below on the screen.